Hey guys, it's Susie with Susie Nails It, and on this video we're going to do an Easter basket. I have this nail prepped with Bali Mist. It is a really pretty, um, let's see, there we go, now we're in focus. It's a really pretty purple. I'm going to set that aside, and I'm going to start out with some white, and I'm just using a basic white by Wet n Wild. And then I'm going to use a dotting tool. Just sort of make, I'm going to get the um, general outline of my basket going here. I'm just going to kind of dot it along here. There we go. And then I'm going to go ahead and make the outline of my basket. There we go, and I'm just going to dot it in. There we go, and I'm going to let a little bit of that purple show through a little bit so it looks like the basket actually has some texture to it. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab several colors I've got some blue, um, I've got some pink, orange, green, just whatever colors you want. And I'm just going to dab a few drops of these various colors down here. There we go. And I'm going to use these to make my Easter eggs for my Easter basket. I'm just going to pick up various colors here. It's got a little bit of fuzz going there. Let me get that off. There we go. We'll get our little Easter basket going there like that. And then I'm going to go back to the white. Probably need a little bit more white on there. There we go. And I still have some fuzz on my dotting tool. Let's see what I can do to get that off. There we go. Okay. I'm going to make the handle of the Easter basket. I'm going to go up here toward the middle so that I can find where. And where I'm going to meet up there. I'm going to kind of fill that in a little bit more over there. Now, at this point, what I need to do is just let this dry. And then I'm going to do just a little bit of an outline with some black to finish off. So just to make it a little more um, finished, more of a finished look. And then um, we'll finish it off with some top coat after that. So what I need to do right now is just to let this dry. So we'll do that and I'll meet you back in a minute. Now this has had a little bit of time to dry. I'm going to go in with my permanent marker, my little Sharpie. Actually, I'm going to move that out of the way there. And I'm just going to make some little marks here in between between some of these. Um, I don't know. I guess um, you'd call them sort of like roping for the basket. 
just to give it a little more definition and a little bit of texture there. So I don't know if you can tell, like right there, you can see how much better that makes it look just by having that little bit of extra there. I'm going to go ahead and add that around several more areas here. Just like that. You can see the outline of everything just a little bit better that way. There we go. And I'm going to do the same thing right in here. Just needs a little bit more on this side. There we go. See how much better that makes it look? Now I'm going to continue doing that around the outer perimeter of the basket. There we go. So there is our cute little Easter basket. So let me know what you think of this one in the comments below. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and follow me at Susie Nails It on Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook. And I hope you guys have a great day.